All right, guys. This is a little video on the Honda Aquatrax um, F12X Turbo. If you're having a problem with your turbo being stuck, and you'll pretty much know it because the ski will only go about 20 to 25, maybe 27 miles an hour, um, it's pretty easy to fix. It should only take you about 15 minutes. You don't have to take it to the shop and spend a bunch of money. Then I'm going to show you how to do it. Take your seats off. Take your fire extinguisher compartment off. And if you look, I know this is going to be kind of hard to see with the phone, but if you look what the turbo intake is, I'll take my hand and go around. This is your intake right here, right here. Just take your intake hose off. It's just two, two uh, this is your intake hose right here in case you don't know what I'm talking about. Pretty easy to recognize. Take your intake hose off and then take, you can take your fingers and stick them down. I know this is hard to see. You can bear with me. Stick them down inside, inside here. And see if you can turn the turbo. Now these things are sharp, so be careful with that. And if you can't turn it at all, all right, it's stuck. But it's pretty easy to fix. And I'm gonna show you how. Get you a nine millimeter. I use a quarter inch drive just because it's small to get to. And it's counterclockwise. There's a nut on the middle of that turbo. <clears throat> turn it counterclockwise. Just give it a little light pressure, and you'll feel it break free. And of course, give it a good shot with some CRC 656. Turn it again, spray it again, turn it again, spray it again, turn it again, and it'll break right free. And then just, you can crank it up and run it and spray it with the intake hose off just to kind of help lube it up some, but you don't have to. But just just do that just for a little while and she'll break right free. And what causes that is condensation and moisture gets in there. It's not a bearing issue or anything like that. It's just condensation. It's a tight fit where that, <clears throat> turbine spins in there and it's just condensation gets it stuck but that will fix it and that should get you back on the water and like I said counterclockwise all right it's a left-handed thread nut so clockwise will loosen it I found that out the hard way but it was easy to get back on but it's counterclockwise and it'll break right free and hopefully that'll solve your problems I hope this video helps and uh, just leave me a comment if it does thanks Sorry for the quality, but I'm fixing mine right now, and uh, this is all I have is my cell phone. Thanks.